Since the structure of DNA was determined in 1953, we have known that the order of the basis is very important, and that a change or mutation in this order can result in diseases. The Human Genome Project saw scientists around the world collaborate to work out the sequences of basis in the human genome. The project started in 1990 and was completed by 2003. By comparing the DNA of people living in different parts of the world, scientists have been able to trace human migrations. The Out of Africa theory that the first humans left Africa within the last 100,000 years has been supported by comparing the DNA of people living in different areas of the globe. The evidence shows which people are more closely related to others. The genome of every person on Earth is 99.9% .9 the same. It's that tiny 0.1% that makes up genes that give us our unique differences. In fact, our genes are 98% similar to a chimpanzee's and 75% the same as a mouse. So, now we have the information, how is it being used? Genes determine our traits, like eye color and freckles. Some genes make people more likely to get certain diseases, like high cholesterol or some cancers, HIV or antibiotic resistance. So much of modern medicine is influenced by people's genes. If only there was a way to change them the way we change a flat tire. It turns out there is. Using a technology called CRISPR, scientists can edit the DNA of the genes that make us who we are. CRISPR lets scientists locate a faulty gene, then cut the DNA strand where it's located to remove, fix, or replace it. The DNA then repairs the cut, and the body goes back to normal. So how can CRISPR advance medicine? It could eliminate inherited conditions, like sickle cell anemia or cystic fibrosis. It could fight cancer by deleting genes to help immune cells attack tumors. It could treat HIV, herpes, or hepatitis by removing the virus's genetic information from the patient's cells. It could prevent antibiotic-resistant infections by removing the resistant genes from bacteria. While CRISPR can be revolutionary, it comes with questions about safety and ethical boundaries. That's why it's critical that scientists continue to safely and responsibly explore this groundbreaking technology for use only in patients with medical need. Because with clinical trials in progress around the world, CRISPR has the potential to change medicine forever.